welcome this is the energy vibration um reading for the virgo's birthdays it is the week of emotion this is the week of um water energy and you're going in the month welcome you virgo's thank you for being here thank you for being back um this is the year 2018 readings for the people who were born um, from the 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 okay from the 10th until the 16th so if you um, if you were um, someone who was born from the 10th until the 16th I want to say to you that this week um, is going to be uh, this is the monthly readings okay for your birthday so after your birthday I'm sorry I'm just having a real hard, but, um after your birthdays um, you are going to be seeing different energies coming out now for the year 2018 for you guys it's a year of building your uh, physical world okay because we are having the Empress it's a year where situation if your mom or father is sick um they're going to be um, in an hospital um, and um, they're going to be sick for some time and you have to find inner strength with this situation okay you really have to find inner strength with this situation um the empress and uh, uh, some of you um, could be moving forward in your life and leaving your partner behind or some of you could be splitting up or some of you could be um if you're married um some of you could be getting married in this year 2018 because right after your birthday is when all this stuff is going to be happening a lot of achievement a lot of situation where you need to look at yourself if you're overusing your power it's going to be a year that some of you are going to become very very psychic some of you are going to be finding religions and group um, for um, protection religions and group for protection okay um, the strength whatever is the energy of the strength some of you have to find inner strength with a situation with your partner with your relationship if you're married you need to find inner strength so it's a year where a lot of stuff is going to affect the parents if you're married if you're in relationships is a year where a lot of stuff because it's the year of the hangman for you guys where the energies for you guys in 2018 is all about you trying to balance find balance for yourself and finding out who you are so um, this is going to be very important in this year so I'm gonna be leaving it there because we're going to go deeper and see in a lot of situation I'm seeing that unexpected things are going to be happening so let's see what is the energy so for the Virgos who are having birthday from the 10th until the 16th what is the energies for you Virgos who are having birthday from the 10th until the 16th um, the energy of the devil is in reverse <laughs> okay so if there was a situation um um with you guys um the energy of the devil is in reverse so your materialistic situation is going to get better okay what's happening with the emperor um the energy of the hermit you no longer um need to find yourself because it's as if you find your true um divine part way your true career your true divine part way okay and then we have uh, the energy of the hierophant and the energy of the hierophant let's see what is coming out with this group of organization a lot of work a lot of work a lot of work a lot of work so some of you could be um, receiving a new position in an organization and it's going to take a lot of work okay let's see what's happening with uh, the married people the lovers the people who have been in relationship for quite some time what's happening um, success um, some of you um, this is the energy of the hemper 
um, so in a relationship with the energy of the hamper um, this is working on your relationship it's, it's as if you're going out looking for help in your relationship you're going out looking for help for your relationships to build okay um, some of you could be partnering up with your love partner to make your wishes and dream come true um, in business and this is going to be um, very good let's see what's happening with uh, um, the chariot um, the energy of the tower is in reverse so um, <laughs> um, what this is saying is that you guys with the energy is that whatever that was blocking you it's is, 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 you know you're ending the year 2017 you're ending the things and then after your birthday you're just going to be moving forward in a positive way forward the hermit the energy of the hermit some of you are going to have a lot of worries some of you could be um, worrying and stressing in this year um, because you have to deal with work and a situation with an organization so there could be some stress and worries so whatever it is that that is coming out there could be some stress and worries okay it has to do with a supervisor or boss or someone um, and you're looking in within and it has to do with an organization so let's see what's happening with the people for strength you're protecting yourself you're basically protecting yourself you're standing your guard and protecting yourself from um, some real um, weird people okay and this could be the energy of the Queen of Wands okay so um, we are going to be looking at that so not to worry because I know you guys are thinking oh but what is happening aren't you gonna tell us about what's happening yes hold on so let's see um, the Empress and the devil it has to do with work the Empress and the devil it has to do with work should be upright it has to be with work okay the Empress and the devil has to be with work I'm just going to do everyone and then we can all see because each and every person is going to have the effect here there's an opportunity that is coming in so not to worry there's an opportunity that is coming in and um, work is going to be coming in some of you are going to be having having new pos um, positions coming in um, whoever this person is that was trying to block you from manifesting it's going to be over um, some secrets are coming out that's why the tower is in reverse and there's an end to your worries no more worries and to your worries and the energy of the star is coming out for you guys so you know all of this there's a, going to be a lot of a, a luck there is going to be a lot of luck coming in for you guys in this year a lot of luck is going to be coming in for you guys in this year okay so let's look and see what's happening for the people who were born on um, the 10th of um, September you have the energy of the Empress and now this is going to be a wonderful year for you guys if your financial situation was blocked before your birthdays and in the, the time before your birthdays um, this is going to be over because the energy of the devil is in the reverse so um, you know if you didn't have any work if your business wasn't doing good and that sort of a thing and it's more an effect of you um, finding the right job if you um, and it doesn't have to be finding the right job it's just your financial stability um, if it was a little bit unbalanced um, not to worry because you're going to be finding a new job okay it's as if someone was taking and blocking your energy and your financial success and in this year 2018 after your birthday you are going to be seeing that these energies is about to lift up and this is going to be good this is just going to be very good okay so that's wonderful now we're looking at the people who was born on the 11th 
and this is a wonderful energy the Emperor because it's also building your stability building your foundation for you guys this year it's all about you trying to manifest the right things and the right situation in your life okay it's as if you want to manifest the right things and the right situations in your life um, you're going to be finding the dream job you're going to be finding the right organization and companies to work with and this is going to be um, extremely extremely good okay um, it's as if whatever that you were thinking and worrying about um, you need no longer whatever that you were trying to find what is the best um, work situation for me it's as if it's just going to automatically come in your life okay so it's as if uh, the hermit your spirit guides is just going to be bringing the right thing in your life it's as if one day you realize hey let me try that uh, maybe um, I, I, I've always liked that and then it's it's, it's just gonna automatically appear in your life okay so that is um, so good that is so good that is really really so good so happy birthday to the people who were born on the 12th oh, yeah on the 12th of um, September um, this is going to be um, a year where you have a lot of work to do with the organization a lot of work um, you're going to be completely you some of you are going to be looking for spiritual groups and organization to connect to it and to work with it's going to be a very very positive year because this is a positive energy especially for the crystal people the crystal energy people it's a positive year a lot of work is going to be coming in for you guys a lot of work is is, is if uh, um, whatever that was blocking you this is going to be opening up because um, I, I some of you could be starting your own business some of you could be advancing in work some of you are finishing studying and it's going to be extremely extremely good what is happening is that um, um, people and organization is as if you some of you are, are finishing off your study and you're going to be picked up right away okay you're finishing off your study and you're going to be picked up right away okay you have nothing to worry about now as we look at the people who were born on the 13th um you have the energy um this is going to affect your love life this year is uh, going to have a huge effect on your love life okay um, be aware because some of you your parents are going to be influencing your love life be aware of that some of you wants to get married um, some of you really wants to get married and be with this person but there is going to be an influence of your family okay um, some of you in organization and uh, um, uh, there's going to become an end to to it whatever situation you have been dealing with your boss some of you are going to just say a hey, listen I'm, I'm out of here okay some of you could be connecting with relationship at work it's not going to be a healthy one do not do it it's going to come to an end don't do these relationships at work they're not always healthy it's going to come to an end some of you are going to be deciding to leave your boss just to leave your boss not to have anything to do with your boss some of you are going to really really just decide to leave your work because you're thinking um, this situation is not really healthy for myself so I'm seeing a hand um, two people whatever the situation is I'm seeing that there is going to become an, an end as we move forward um, we see um, a, a situation where um, you have the energy with uh, um, moving forward moving forward this is um, extremely good um, a lot of movement some of you could be moving houses moving place um, a lot of um, um, openings a lot of moving I'm seeing people move into different places different organization different business um, that sort of a thing 
I'm seeing whatever that was blocking you, holding you back is come to an end. Secrets are going to be revealed about a situation. Secrets are going to be revealed about a situation. It's as if um, someone was basically holding you back from moving forward and secrets are going to be revealed. Now, um, the energy of the hermit, the energy of the hermit is here. Whatever the worries was that you have been carrying is as if you're going to go within in this year and you're going to see that all the worries is just worries and nothing. Um, you know, all this worries is just going to come to an end. Whatever the situation is, whatever that is transpiring, you're going to be seeing that your worries that you have been carrying for a very long time is just going to end. It's just going to come to an end. Um, no more worries. Um, everything is just going to turn out perfectly. Okay, so you need not to worry. For the people who were born on the 16th, it's going to be a wonderful year. You have the energy of the number eight, but you also have a number nine and the star. Now, what does this mean? This means that um, you have um, um, used your inner strength um, to come through a situation and you come out the star. Okay, you have used your inner strength to come through a situation and you have come out to be the star and success a lot of success is going to be um coming at you and really a lot of success is going to be coming at you now um there is um a lot of luck that is coming in um some of you um someone who is um over the age of 40 that is a that is a um mm and Aries Leo or Sagittarius is going to be bringing you some luck okay um, there is um, an unknown uh, situation that is going to be happening to some of you in this uh, new year and let's see what is this unknown situation that is going to be happening what is it that we are not aware of um, okay justice okay all right so what is happening is that we have the energy of an unknown situation that was transpiring the three of ones you're turning your back to a situation you were stabbed in the back um and you were stabbed in the back by the knight of wands um so be aware with the people who are Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. Be aware of people who are Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius because they're, they have uh, tried to do something of injustice, but justice came up. Justice, uh, justice came up. Okay, justice. Um, the situation has been now justified because the Knight of Wands, which is a, a really um this honest person did something and um now justice has intervened and um and um you are coming out on top so be aware of this um ladies and gentlemen that um if someone if you get in a situation with someone that is uh, and uh, um with someone that is and uh, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius between the ages of um, 25, between the ages of 25 and 40, um, this person has done something injustice. And um, this person, you turn your back to a situation, and you move away, and this person stab you in the back. They're now in the reverse, and justice took them on. And justice has now took them on. So um, justice, um, you fight for injustice and equalities, you guys, because you're going to be coming out on top. Now you have the energy of the number seven. You have the energy of the I, um, the I princess of spirit. You have the energy of the I princess of spirit. The I princess of spirit is going to guide and protect you guys in this year. 2018 okay before I leave I just want to um, tell you guys your numbers so for the people who were born on the 10th you have number uh, three 
um, 14 and 15 3 14 and 15 you can work with these numbers in any way you would like to do for the people who were born on the 11th you have um, the energy of um, 4 9 and 30 4 9 and 30 4 9 and 30 okay as we look at the people who were born under 12 we have the energy of um, 5 1 and 19 5 1 and 19 now you actually have 11 also because 10 um, is a 1 okay now the energy of the debt and of okay so what is happening here is that we have the energy of the lovers and with the energy of the lovers what is happening for you guys you have the number of six eight and um six eight and four you have the energy of six eight and four okay um there's an ending um if your mom is a if your mom is a um Aries Leo or Sagittarius there might come an end a debt she might pass away she might pass away okay she might pass away um if your partner is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius over the age of 40 she might pass away okay this is why um these two energies actually are funeral okay as we look at the people who were born on the 14 you have 7 um, 26 which uh, an 8 and uh, um, the tower 16 and 7 okay so you have twice 7 so you're on the right part the right journey okay then we're looking at the people who were born on the 5 the 15th and we have 9 2 times 9 36 which is another nine so for you guys who were born on um, the 15th of September for the coming year there's a lot of endings a lot of endings of cycle in your life because this is nine this is nine and this so it's this end of the cycle of worries in your life so this is nine this is nine and this is also nine and then you have 36 so you have three times nine which is the end of the cycle a wake up call that you should find your spirituality this is what this is saying for you guys in this year now for the people who were born on the 16th you have the energy of eight strength nine of ones and the star now what this is saying for you guys is that the eight and the nine and 16 16 and one is seven so you have seven um eight nine and 16 okay so you're working with all these numbers in this year you are going to be very successful and you're going to make a lot of money in this year the eight uh, the infinity and the star is always that success is coming in and you're going to be financial stable okay okay so um, ha um happy new year for you guys because it's the beginning of your new year and i want to say to each and every person thank you for being here Thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful support please like share these videos thumbs up and leave a message and don't forget to go back and listen to the monthly reading because there's a lot of information that you can receive from that that is going to be helping you in this week namaste until next time